Miguel Beerman, Danny Siegel. Pangalawang PBA Conference pa lamang ni Danny sa kanyang rookie year. Ngunit parang veterano na ang kanyang mga kilos at diskarte. Yes sir, welcome na naman sa ating PBA Throwback. Ikadalawamputlimang season ng PBA noong 1999. Sa season na to, madami po ang nangyari. May mga ilang kontrobersya na naging usap-usapan. Isa na nga po dito yung pagkapanalo ni Benji Paras ng Most Valuable Player na may mga ilang nagsasabi na dapat daw ay eh yung rookie na si Danny Siegel. Sa All-Filipino Cup, nag-champion ang shell ang kupuna ni Benji Paras. Habang nakuha naman ng SMB ang kampiyonato ng Commissioner's Cup at Governor's Cup. At dito sa ating PBA throwback, ating ipapakita yung nangyari sa PBA Commissioner's Cup Finals sa pagitan ng SMB at ng Shell Game 6 na kung saan tinapos ng Beermen ang Shell para makuha ang kampiyonato. At makikita din natin dito yung napakatinding mga matchup una sa mga import sa SMB si Terkin Mot kung hindi nyo na po naabutan si Terk Mot itanong nyo po sa mga tito nyo kung gaano kahalimaw maglaro ang import na to abay syempre mga sir hindi rin padadaig yung import ng Shell apelyido pa lang e mahusay na si Jan Bess idagdag mo pa dyan yung matchup sa pagitan ni Benji Paras at Danny Ildefonso at Victor Pablo at Danny Siegel. Yes sir, at narito na ang mga huling minuto sa PBA Commissioner's Cup Finals Game 6 sa pagitan ng SMB at ng Shell noong 1999. If there's any time to show it, it's just about the right time now. Lead is down to 9. Wala sa loob si Benji Parasa, so ito si Chris Jackson taking some of the offense. Oh, ang ulit mo. Grabe, Nick Velasco naman ngayon. Kanina si Dwight Nago. Nice throw. Ang ganda ng kanyang follow through doon. Nick Velasco with four points. Ito na kanyang production back in game number five. So again, the bench coming out here. Oh, inahuli! Si John Best, si Danny Segal. And there's gonna be a loose ball foul here. If this is on John Best, oh boy! Yes, it is on John Best. Nangapat na rin ni John Best yan. So pareho na sila ni Turk Mott ngayon. Yun yung mga useless partner. Tama ka ron. So na-frustrate lang siya dun sa situation na yun. Kaya siya pumawal at medyo kailangan. May mangyari na rito. Ano mong problema na tuloy si Coach Perry Roquillo. Ang layo na lang tingin ni Perry Roquillo. Napaka malalim. Obviously, he's now beginning to feel the pressure. Outside shots of light. Tommy Nacelle on the attack. Labing isa ang kanilang inahabol. Kapasok po tayo sa siyang na minuto sa final quarter. Pablo is open. Field DT Ball. This is shot. Yes. And Victor Pablo cuts down the lead with eight points. Well, that's a good gamble there by Vic Pablo. Hindi naman talaga siya known as a three-point shooter. Pero binigay sa kanya yung opening. Might as well make it. That's what you need at this point. Victor Pablo was average. Oh, ano yung tira na naman? Peter Mott. Mott na naman. Ang uh, minaster na tira dun sa side. Ayan, pump up na pump up pa rin si Turk Mott. Sinasagot na naman na San Miguel yung lahat na ibinibigay ng uh, Formula Shell. Medyo nakakaamoy na sila rito eh. Oo. Oh, parang tigre pag nakaamoy ng dugo. Eh tuloy-tuloy na yan. Lalo tumatapang. Turk Mott with his usual pistols out in the game. And look at that. Oh, yes sir. <laughs> binalik naman yan. Oo, oh, binalik naman. <laughs> May lisensya kaya yun? Sampung ko. Sampung ko ang abante ng San Miguel. John Bess is hemmed in. And there's a foul. Laban kay Dynamite, Danny Siegel. That'll send JB to the free throw line. Second foul is Siegel. With 8 and 25 remaining in the final quarter of game number 6. Benji Parra still on the bench. You know, alam natin na medyo foul trouble siya. Pero ang tanong dito is, uh, i-risk muna ba si Benji Parra pagka ganito situation na? No? Ikaw, Yeg. Ikaw ang tatanayin ko ito dahil ikaw ang coach. Okay, i-risk muna. Siyempre. Ito na yung ano eh. Wala nang bukas kung matatalo kayo ngayon. First free throw converted. Patuloy sa ating mga bituin dito, Congressman Henry Lanot ng Lone District ng Pasig. Welcome! 
sa inyong bayan ng superstars. Actually, tayong uh, hinuhost ni Congressman Lanot oh, dito Lanot. sa venue na to. And what a crowd we have here today. No place like home, no place like the PBA. 63 to 55, si Congressman Herrera ng 6th District ng Cebu, Efren Herrera. Welcome din. Talagang... Daming VIPs dito. Ikaw naman, kailangan ka magiging congressman. Wag, wag, wag. Mahirap na yan. Mahirap na trabaho yan. Eto, si Danny Siegel. Parang tumigil yata ang negosyo sa labas ngayon. Dahil naman sa PBA. Kaya ngayon si Kurt Mott Supply at kapitawan ni Lago yung rebound. Mananatili ang bola sa panig ng Formula Shell. Well, they're coming back here. Formula Shell is trying to come back with less than 8 minutes remaining in the final quarter. 63-55. Ocho puntos ko ang kabante. Libre na naman si Victor Pablo sa play. Offensive rebound na kuha. Ibinalik ko Pablo. Sumaksak sa loob. Pinangga si Mott. And that will remain with Formula Shell. Kiniswerte pa sila. Dahil hindi nakukuha ng San Miguel. At ngayon, si Benji Paras ay babalik sa laro. And of course, ang ating suki sa PBA, Ambassador Tony Villamor. Kaibigan-kaibigan niya ng Vintage Family. Itong minuto, labing tatlong saglit. Yan, itong lamang na to, 8 puntos, hindi pa to sigurado. Ah, hindi pa, no? Medyo delikado pa yan para sa San Miguel. Di rin ay Concordia. Talaga namang ang daming tao. Ulan na lang dito yung mga kaibigan ni partner na Willie Marshall. Oh, offensive pal dito. Laban kay John Best. Naku! Oh, lima na. Aray. Aray. Naku naman. Sos. Aray. Kupo. 7.05 remaining and he has 5 fouls and he is shaking his head. Oh, napapailing na lang siya dahil nung last game may inabutan siya ng 5 fouls. Natalo sila ron. Oh, hindi na siya pwedeng i-pull out ni Coach Perry Rantoya dito. Kailangan sugal na talaga ito. Tuloy-tuloy na ito. Eh si Benji Paras, sinusugal na rin dito. Kaya naman natin si Paras, meron din taklong personal fouls. Mop, yun na naman yung same angle. Wala. Rebound ni John Best. Gives it to his plana. They're still down by just eight. Oh, this is just plan. In the last, Castillo pulls the trigger. Voila. Rebound it. From three-point range, we know he can shoot much better than that in the championship series. Rosella, he will take a field in the long distance. Voila. Rebound it, John Best again. Makikita mo rito yung determination ng San Miguel defense. They're always there stopping the fast break and transition game of Shell. Tama yan. Mabilis ang baba nila pagdating sa fast break. Eh. At ngayon, uh, sa pagsaksak ni John Bess, si Freddy Butay, datawa ka na kanyang ikatlong foul. That will send JB to the free throw line. Well, partner, meron lang akong uh, babanggitin dito. Merong fundraising exhibition game between Tanduay and San Miguel Pier. Nagaganapin sa Goodyear Gym sa Las Piñas sa September 25 po, alas 4 ng hapon. Ito po ay fundraising exhibition game. Tawagan niyo po si Janet Altamirano sa numero 805-5008 for more information. May mga import na siguro dyan, ano? Yung, yung mga, mga bago. Sa third conference, Oo. yes. Makikita niyo yung mga bagong import dyan. Of course, ang... Ito uh, po na ng mga... Marami ng import na nagtatingan dito. Halos lahat yata, nandyan na. Eh. Oo. Less than a quarter, half a quarter remaining here. Dia ni Mott. Short, rebound ni Vic Pablo. Oh, inaabangan na yung tira niyang yun eh. So, kailangan mag-iba naman siya. Either pass to or drive to the basket. This lead is just six. And another foul. Nasa penalty na San Miguel. And now, Shell is coming back via the free throw line. Ito, ang balik ng Shell na to with the illegal defenses of San Miguel. Marami silang binigay na puntos doon sa foul line. At meron pang mga foul shots na binibigay pa rin. Pinag-usapan natin ang odds, Ying, nung uh, nagpasimula tayo ng ating coverage. Let's talk more about odds since 1991. Five of the eight teams which won Game 5 after a 2-0 series went on to win the championship. But only three in the last six na nagawa po. Medyo bumababa yung percentage na yun. Pero marami pa rin ang nakakapanalo ng kampinato pag ito nanalo ng Game number 5. That's a... Alam mo, malaking bagay na yun eh. Makaangat ka lang ng few percentage points above 50%. Oh. So, ibig sabihin, lamang ka na. Percentage-wise. 
Pero ito ang formula shell. They have not lost their last seven do or die games. The last one being that do or die game against Santa Lucia back in game number five. No semifinals and now they're coming back once again. Apat na lamang ang abante na San Miguel. This is game six. Kinuha lang talaga sa tiyaga ng shell ito with their defense. There's a foul. Pero unti-unti ha, nakita natin hindi biglang naging 4 yan So sinaga talaga ng Shell ito, unti-unti nila At saka yung depensa nila, umiiraw na naman dito Yeng Ang problema na San Miguel sa akin palagay, ito si Mote Panayang uh, birada na dun sa kanyang comfort zone na yun Na wala na nangyayari sa kanya Meron ng kasamang overconfidence si Mote Baka akala niya tapos na itong laro nito Ito so, yan They go back to man game on the left side. Mott, Binalikia, Rosella, he takes the long shot. Nothing there. Rebound. Nakuha na Estrada. Here's Jerry. John Best. Leap is a pass. He pulls the trigger. Nothing there. And it's stopped out by Freddy Abudai to remain with Formula Shell. And the Zoom Masters are coming back in a big way. This is not yet over. This is game number six of the finals. Samang Noli, kailangan siguro i-congratulate na natin yung ating uh, commissioner at yung commissioner staff no, doon sa kanyang uh, opisina. Napakagandang uh, series ito at napakagandang conference ng uh, uh, commissioner staff. Talaga naman, eh, wala nang dadayot pa. Talaga naman, uh, buhay na buhay. Ang, ating, uh, ang inyong liga, ang PBA, salamat sa inyong lahat. 63 to 59, San Miguel. Medyo nagiging defensive ang game ng San Miguel ngayon. Ah, Yeng, parang ayaw nilang ano eh. Biglang nagkakalangan sila. Oh, oh. Pinabayo. <laughs> Pero okay pa rin naman yan. Uh, those two guys are friends. Oh, yeah. Eh, pagkalamanan talaga. Wala mo lang ano, wala mo na kaibigan-kaibigan. There is Plana. Yun, sinakayang si Olsen Rosella. Si Plana, of course, Plana oh, oh. kung isang beda. Si Plana, rather si Rosella naman. Produkto ng Ateneo. Oo. Oh, oh. Tatlo at tatlong minuto, limampot, apat na segundo po na lalabi sa final quarter. San Miguel is still holding on to the lead. They need one more win. Seagull, in and out. Oh, the first one! Oh, bola. Tapulig, gusto niya ibalik for the foul. Oh, oh. oh and uh, pwede mo nalang i-rebound. Ibalik sa labas ang bola ulit. Ito na yung, ano, yung composure, yung poise. Tama. Championship experience will count in this situation. Pablo gives it to Paras. He takes the three-point shot. Nothing there. Rebound in third block. 3-19 remaining. <laughs> what a game. What a style on Sunday. to 59, but Formula Shell is on the attack here. They need to score Ito Yeng. Kailangan, kailangan. Kung hindi, talagang mga ngamoy championship para sa San Miguel. Para sa Bitaway! Malakas yung talbog ng dribble niya eh. Oo, buhubuelo na sana siya, pero napalakas nga yung talbog. And now, San Miguel Beer has an opportunity to stretch their lead here. Mot. Pumasok sa gitna. Pumira. Yes, sir! Perkin to the hook! Ito na. 27 points, 16 rebounds para kay Turk Mott. Two plays yung na pinabanggit natin. Turk Mott going inside. Nakikita si Ildefonso. Sasapayan siya ni Benji Paras. But the man from Lawan, Samar, again to the rescue. Freddy Abuda getting the points. And then, sabi ni Mott, hindi ko na ipapasa ngayon. Ako na ang gagawa mismo ng putos. And that's back-to-back -back baskets for San Miguel. And they're on top by eight with only 2.16 remaining. Uli, kasamang Nooli, yung talagang uh, main play nila ang pumatay dito sa shell. Alex si John Best, but that's a quick two points. Yes, you can, all, you can almost be sure here that they'll give the ball to the post kay Turkin Mott and create some situations from then on. And the last two minutes is brought to you by London Gin Jr. Now in a handy shooter size, London Gin Jr. just right for you. Here's the pass, wala, rebound. So now, hindi ba kailangan pumuntos dito ng San Miguel? Ano? Kailangan lang nila na uh, i-hold down or uh, use up yung kanilang uh, shot clock dito. And everyone is up with the balloons for tonight. They have to first a turn over here. Mott, nasa labas. A lot of time sa kanilang shot clock. He goes inside. That's a win! Ang bali 
sinakyan na siya pero idinakdak pa rin niya when the going gets tough Perkin Cuba Mott gets going watch this move sumakay ka pa and Perkin Mott with 29 points at ang San Miguel 8 points ang abante with only a minute 42 we'll be back <laughs> It's still an eight-point lead para sa San Miguel Yang at at this point, medyo kailangan na talaga humanap ng milagro si Perry Longquillo. Kailangan na at forsado na rin sila dito na, uh, well, for some turnovers, maybe gamble on their fouls yun, just to stop the clock. They are in the penalty at yung foul na yan ay iahapit si Danny Siegel sa free throw line. Ito yung huling galaw ni Turk Mott. He is the only balik import who has not won a championship Well, tonight, with this shot, he is showing that, well, I deserve a title. <laughs> Ayan na. Kita mo naman yan. Pambihira. At uh, actually, sa ganito situation, you know, when the adrenaline is pumping up, and then ito si Turk Mott, eh, with that kind of build and with his strength, it's almost impossible to stop him once he starts going to the basket. Idinidiin na niya na husto dito, eh, dito sa huling dalawang minuto. Jongo Wichiko trying to join a rare breed. It is a PBA, a rookie coach, trying to win a first title in his first season. The lead is up to nine with only a minute and a half remaining. Esplana, Tumira Salabas, wala. Rebound, Kinoa na naman ni Mott. 17 rebounds today para kay Turk Mott. Well, wala na talagang options for Shell other than just try and go for those quick two points. Or if ever, pag kami opening ko sa free post, sugal mo na rin. Danny Siegel goes inside. Nabitawan ng bola. And look at Mott dive for the liver. Siegel gives it up to Siegel. Oh, wala na siya. Sobra na yan. Hindi sobra na yan. Sobra na yan. Grabe na yan. Only that much time remaining. And Mike Castillo taking a fieldy deal on this and shot. Para matap niya sa kapatil. San Miguel sa anim. Babuhay pa. Hindi pa kumakala. Championship caliber team. And San Miguel Beer is only 26 seconds away from the PBA Commissioner's Cup round. The player for Danny John Besson. Well, Formula Shell tried their best thing. Wala ka nang masasabi, no? There's nothing really that they have to be ashamed about. Nakabalik sila from 0-2. At one point, sabi ng mga tao, baka sila na nga ang mag-champion dito. Pero alam mo, ganyan talaga. Swerte rito si basketball. Eh. San Miguel proving that well, kalakan mo, hindi lamang isa, hindi lamang dalawa o taklo, but the whole team. And they certainly responded. Eight seconds remaining. The celebration has begun. It is the Phil Sports Arena. That much time remaining before San Miguel is crowned the PBA Commissioner's Cup Champions for 1999. Joe Romichico receiving the victory ride. A well-deserved ride for this head coach, this rookie head coach.